Many political experts this morning saying this is actually just the beginning. The most recent move uh, really is a result of the mounting pressure from political leaders, including President Joe Biden, pretty much all other LA city council members and political activists from all across Southern California. 49 year old Nuri Martinez, who represents the sixth district here in Los Angeles, has officially resigned her seat on the LA city council. And in a statement, she said, It was simply hard to say goodbye. Political experts say this is yet another sign of the enormous fallout that has followed the racist conversation that was leaked last weekend. LA Mayor Eric Garcetti was one of several public officials who was in strong support of Martinez's resignation. In a statement, he said, quote, Racism and hateful words cannot ever be overlooked by our community or within oneself, and she needs the time and space to reflect. Make amends and move forward with her life. End quote. The fallout comes just days after 2021 audio recordings were published in which Martinez is heard making racist remarks while talking with fellow council members Kevin De Leon and Gil Cedillo and labor leader Ron Herrera about how the city's council district boundaries should be redrawn. The conversation included several racist comments regarding council member Mike Bonin's two year old adopted black son. All of them apologized. Herrera and Martinez both resigned, but the two others have decided to stay on. Resignation of Councilwoman Martinez is the right first step. And to also say that council members Cedillo and De Leon must follow suit. It was a second straight day of vocal protests at the city council meeting. It forced the panel of the meeting and uh, to cancel the meeting rather and move all the agenda items to Friday's meeting. Activists shouted, they booed, chanted inside and outside city hall. They say they won't stop until De Leon and Cedillo resign their council seats. The attorney general will now be investigating LA's redistricting process and the origins of that controversial meeting that led to those racist comments. The uh, next city council meeting scheduled for tomorrow at 10 a.m. That is the very latest here from downtown LA. I'm Carlos Herrera, KTLA 5 News. I'll send it to you guys.